New developments tonight in a story that we broke in our newscast at 5 o'clock today. A now retired Houston police officer indicted. Now this stems from a burglary back in February when investigators say Bruce Johnson shot a man who had just burglarized Johnson's home. Earlier today we heard from the DA's office. Now we're getting a response from HPD Chief Art Acevedo. Channel 2 Sophia Bosley joining us live outside the Harris County Courthouse downtown. Sophia. Well, Bill, in a statement, the police chief says that he is disappointed by the now retired officer's actions. Bruce Johnson, a 22 year veteran of the police force and now retired officer, is charged with tampering with evidence and assault. We've always interacted since the time that we've been here, taking them some gifts, and they've always been real hospitable. Uh, and it's just it been, it been a blessing to be able to live next to him, knowing that he was a police officer and kind of that security that he brought to this neighborhood. Guillermo Rodriguez lives right behind Johnson, describes him as a kind and helpful neighbor. Guillermo wasn't home when a man burglarized Bruce Johnson's house four months ago, but thought the case was closed. I uh, didn't realize that it was an ongoing investigation and was definitely very surprised that it was being said that he was involved in something further than what he was doing. The Harris County District Attorney's Office says Johnson was in uniform but off duty when he confronted the suspect, Derek Carr, which continued down the street. Johnson shot Carr once in the back and elbow, and the DA's office says cell phone video shows the off duty officer kicking Carr and moving a piece of evidence. Additionally, Following the completion of the investigation, the officer admitted to moving a key piece of evidence, the burglary tool that he claimed had been used to threaten him by the burglar. In a statement, Police Chief R. Acevedo says, quote, while the circumstances in this case on the day of occurrence suggested no wrongdoing, a proper impartial investigation by HPD Special Investigation Unit led to the discovery of facts and evidence resulting in the indictment of this former employee. The Houston Police Department remains committed to transparency and accountability. We reached out to Derek Carr's attorney. They said that they are not commenting at this time. We also went to Bruce Johnson's home. He was not at the home at the time either. Reporting live from downtown Houston, Sophia Bosley, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Sophia.